So Q is equal to MC delta T, which is T final minus T initial. Um, we don't know Q, and we don't know T final. So you can't have two unknowns. So let's use what we do know. We know the relationship between Q cold and Q hot, and it's not this. You need a negative sign. Okay, Q cold is equal to the heat in the opposite of the heat in the hot water. And then we can say mass of cold times specific heat of cold times T final, which is the same for both, minus T initial cold is equal to the opposite of mass of hot, C of hot, T final minus T initial hot. And then you can plug in your numbers. Simplify this a little by canceling out the 4.18, which you can only do since you have the same substance here. If you had like aluminum in water, you wouldn't be able to do that and your math would just be a little bit crazier. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to mult I'm going to divide each side by negative 65. You don't have to do your algebra exactly this way, but here's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so here's what I got. One thing I will say, make sure you carry your numbers out to a few decimal places so it doesn't mess up your final answer. Um, the next thing I'm going to do is distribute this to my TF and my 19.3. All right, I did that. Make sure that you have your, um, that you've changed your sign here because negative times a negative is gonna give you a positive. And then from here, I'm just going to subtract 24.348 from both sides. And in addition, you can do these as two separate steps if you want. I'm going to subtract one TF over here. Subtract one TF over here. I'll put a little one there, it'll make it a little clearer. Just make sure you have your signs right. And now I'm just going to divide both sides by negative 2.262. And then I will have finally isolated final temperature, which comes out to 49.36 degrees Celsius. And then one last thing you want to check is to make sure that this is a sensible value. Okay, this is in fact in between 87 and 19. And it's actually a little bit closer to like the, the 19 than it is to the 87, which makes sense because you had a little bit more mass of the cold water than you did the hot.